Uh, get that out of the way. Hi, I'm Jordan Long, and today, where some folks might be afraid of the Internal Revenue Service, well, those are all French borrowed words, and some folks might be afraid of other things, I don't know, maybe the, maybe, maybe the part, maybe United States Department of Citizenship and Nationalization, some might be afraid of the Border Patrol, and hell, well, just put it out there. Some might be afraid of Federal Bureau of Investigation, more French borrowed words. And others might be afraid, you know, of the Central Intelligence Agency. And some might be afraid of the National Security Agency or even the Department of Homeland Security itself. More French borrowed words, except for Homeland Stronghold. Well, some folks like me are afraid of Federal Trade Commission or the land leadership trade team. Anyway, yeah, I am definitely frightened that I, that even though I'm doing everything right, that I got myself not for kids since I know that I'm for everyone, grown-ups and tweens, I'm still frightened of getting in some kind of hang-up with them. Somebody either flagging it in or however, or reporting it to them somehow, either by calling it in or email, or, you know, or mailing it in or sending it in. You know? And it's not like I have a whole lot of income around here to, uh, to, to play with when it comes to fines and other stuff. So I'm truly frightened with that. You know. But. Yeah. I don't know. See there's a lot of. This is going on. This is not going on. Here's how they're going to do it. Here's how they're not going to do it. No one truly knows. You know. Now. Everyone assumes that they're just going to come in, you know, unknown to you and just start looking at shit and saying, okay, this is good. This is bad. This is good. This is bad. You know, most likely I think, I think it's going to be, uh, where someone has to report it in, someone has to flag it in. I know reports a French bar word, flagged by a French bar word to, to them, and then they come in and look at it, you know? And I'm definitely frightened that I might be in bad standing with them. See, and it doesn't really need, if you're in good standing with YouTube fellowship oversight or the ownership law oversight, as if they're good with them. And I know that my films are for everyone. And that's not just me saying that. I know that to be true. You know, the things I talk about in my films and the things I do in my films and the folks who watch my films are grown up in tweens. No kids here. You know. So, yeah. Definitely I'm frightened of that. Of the Federal Trade Commission. And I know that that probably isn't what they're going for. I know in their mind, they're probably thinking, oh, well, if you're frightened of us, that means you've got something to hide. That's probably not what they're going for. You know, that is what it is. So if they are watching stuff already in hell, there's no, there's no thing that says they can't start taking request is in. So I don't know how it works. But I'm going to go with like how it always works. You either have to call it in or you have to go write it in or send it in. In this case, it would be a YouTube fairway, meaning you would have to send in the address of the YouTube fairway and the name of the YouTube fairway and for them to look at it. And if they would always ask you, oh, what's the name of the man or woman that runs it, you wouldn't know. 
you know, things like that, and then have them look at it, you know, and then do you either get an email from them if you have your, if you have, or something, or some way they, they let you know what they bought, yeah, that's if you haven't already went on their webstead and, and wrote something about what they're going to do or what's going on with the oversight or the law or whatever, you know, definitely frightened of that going on like this. We looked at your shit, Jordan, and we think your shit's, uh, you know, it's good, you know, that, yeah, you got dolls and stuff in it, but yeah, it looks like your stuff for everyone. Yeah, that's if you're lucky. And if I'm lucky, and I keep, I keep asking God to keep me well from this. Yeah, that's funny too, right? You know? Now I know some folks would say, oh, maybe you need to get off. No, me do this and do that. Um, you know, or even worse than that, it gets even, might get even worse than that. Like, what if they say, oh, well, looks like you are in a hang up because it looks like you don't fall for everybody you know so but we looked at you and the only kind of income you got is what you're getting for a social security administration or the team stronghold geld so it looks like fines won't work so most likely will be here better shift that for kids and be good at the end of it but then the truth is from what i talk about I would be, I am for everyone. So I'm not actually frightened of that, but you know, I know I'm for everyone. And it's not just me talking out of my butt. Like I'm sure there's a lot of folks that say, I know that, that I'm for everyone. You know, it's not just some belief fought or take I have. You know, I'm not going to go and write myself down for something that. It's not going to be true. It definitely not what I have about some films that are age restricted. And even when the things I talk about and do in my films aren't necessarily fit are mostly things that only grown ups and tweens would actually like and would actually understand, you know? So yeah, I am frightened of that, but at the same time, What's that going to do? You know, I think I'm I'm good. All right. And of course, one of the worst sad things you could do is make a film where you're sobbing about your fright and what they are or are not going to do. If your YouTube fairway is or is not flagged or reported to them or told to them somehow, you know, because that would be even more. That would be unlooking and shameful. But I'm sure that it probably isn't the first, and it probably is not the last. You know? Like, what would they think? Jeez, we didn't know how bad that was. It was never our goal to have someone make a film sobbing how they were frightened of us coming in, how they were frightened of what of frightened of someone either reporting or flagging our film to us that they were doing something wrong or when they weren't doing something wrong man that don't come off good yeah it doesn't come off good at all but i get the end of the day that's probably what that's probably what you're going for and these if that's not what they're going for there's probably some to work to say yeah we hear that all before you know, the evil doers that, that claim that they're not doing evil. Well, in this case, in this time, I am a good doer that's doing good. I'm not some evil doer that's saying, oh, that I'm doing good. You know, not like that. I'm actually a good doer that actually is doing good. So it's not like I'm some kind of evil doer that sobs and says, I'm not doing evil. I'm doing good. Well, the truth is I'm a good doer. It's doing good. You know, but it is what it is. And Jordan says, I have, ugh, why do I keep saying like my name on over again? You know, I'm talking, you know, I'm speaking. 
Um, you know, and so far I have kept it together. I have keep it or kept it together so I don't start doing that sobbing. But hey, if it happens, it happens. What are you going to do? You know, it is what it is, you know. I mean, I'm for everyone. And uh, I don't want to go and market as such. And then someone says, well, I saw some. And then somebody says, well, I think some of these films that are pri some of these films are ones on the ones that are age restricted or whatever you want to call them. Because we know age and restricted are French forwards. Oh, those might be the bad ones. You know. Or, you know, what's not stopping someone from, you know, coming in and falsely saying you know, fakely saying something that you're doing wrong when you're not. How would they know the unlike between the true flagging of the film to them and someone just lying? Because there are going to be folks that will lie and there will be folks that will lie and say, you need to look at this film when the film isn't doing anything wrong. Yeah, what, what do I do at that point? Just now I'm frightened that someone could like fakely send, could like lie and say the film's doing wrong when the film's not doing wrong. And then I get in a lawful hang up that I wouldn't, that I don't really know how to get myself out of. Well, we would look at it and then we would make our guess basing on what we saw in the film and what was being done in the film. Yeah, sure. So, I guess I am starting to get sad now. And if I don't stop the film soon, I'll be sobbing. And that's going to be even more unlooking and, and shameful. Or at least just unlooking. But it is what it is, you know. But I'm still going to be here next year. Because even though I'm getting frightened and sad over this, I still believe that I'm for everyone, and I know I'm for everyone, and I'm going to be in good standing with every, every gathering, you know, either if it be with YouTube or with the leadership. I'm Jordan Long, and I'll see you later.